Guess where I'm at. I'm gonna give you a few seconds. Three, two, one. I know it's a bit difficult to kind of tell, but if you know, you know. In Morocco. Is that your I kind of flipped you, I that. You're gonna get on the main road, yeah? this one before. Chicken Big Mac. Are you not subscribed? <laughs> You're still not subscribed? <laughs> First time having a Big Mac chicken, so we'll see what the story is. To be honest, I'm gonna be very honest with you guys. We shouldn't be eating a McDonald's. And you know why. It's not bad. Big apartment. Here's my bed. Yo! <laughs> I claimed it. I claimed it. Jump with me. Just get started. Up, up, up. What a beautiful view to wake up to Allah Mabarak. Morocco is actually so underrated, you know, so much better than I expected, even though I've been here before. It still catches me off guard. So we actually came to Morocco to climb Mount Tabqal But before that we were just like listen Let's come back to Ghazout, hit a surf And then we climb the mount These boys are just going up the hill And they're already out of breath <laughs> It's going to be a long trip why then man? It's just one of them ones where I like to the end of the day, the sun hit you nice, you're well fed. What are you doing? What are you putting sugar into your black That's coffee? What they're doing here for culture. I'm gonna take it twisted, I don't usually do this in my own setting. But I'm here, I gotta respect their culture. That's what Loza does on the slide. Yeah, they add sugar to the coffee beans. No, I don't do that. But if you are a guy who likes sugar for your coffee, at Loza we have sugar. <laughs> at Loza we come and day. Every door is a piece of art in Morocco. Look, every door. We're dropping off all our stuff and then we're gonna go surfing. Probably not gonna catch any waves because we're that bad. But eh, this for the experience. I like all the to Tarazout, caught a few waves, surfed a little, rather than went, had a coffee, had food. Because that's all these boys do. All they do is have coffee, have food. I have to actually convince them to partake in the culture. Tarazout is a surfing village. Come do some surfing. You don't know how to surf, learn how to surf. Khalik, hobbies. Ahmed, yesterday he didn't want to surf and then he surfed. We should ride fear. Who's sick? <laughs> Got done with a two hour, actually three hour surf. We're gonna pray Asr. <laughs> gonna have the fattest meal. I don't know why it is, but every single time you do any water related activity, you get so hungry. It's definitely got to do with your body just using a lot of calories to maintain equilibrium of the core temperature. Also, another thing that I found fascinating is that. The little area that don't have um, taps, and this is every little area I've been. I'll show you now. So, can on the little area of the little. As you can see, that's how it goes. You pick a bucket, you fill it up. It's a mouth. <laughs> Took off my watch and look at this tan line. You know when you're so wrecked that you find yourself nearly sleeping in Sujud. Yeah, you're just praying that the Imam doesn't get up. You're just like, listen, bro, take your time. Make dua. Now's the time. And the energy is 
down and when you're hungry and you're tired the man is somehow boosted it's almost like fasting itself boosts your amen i'm pretty much fasting right now we only had a double stress out of three hours sir why tonight i think we're probably gonna go to mount Abad. we should have went today well, we were just like, let's try another day of surfing. Let me tell you what. Ahmed, my surf skills, what do you think? <laughs> Anas is going to be honest with you. Ahmed is a weak Raoul. <laughs> Raoul, remember that? Anas will gas it a bit too much as well. Take between Anas' gassing and Ahmed's uh, digit. Hey guys, man, let's cut waves today, bro. Anas, what? am I a surfer dude than no? Because we sick waves. Oh, exactly. You're definitely a, a surfer dude, bro. So see, I told you, Anis is gonna gas it too much, and this guy is gonna uh, egg them. So nah, it's nah, in the nah. middle. No, 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 no. I'm not. I'm not gassing. I'm being honest, bro. He crushed some sick waves. There was one, yeah. From my perspective, it was like a building-sized wave, bro. And yeah, he was on it like, hey guys, you see me surfing, man? Bazaar the dunya kulla. They are going to be fishing Spilled half of it out. Wallah, I just spilled half of it out. But Adi, I wanted to be concentrated. What's more him? Hey, Bismillah. Let's give it a taste test. Needs more sugar, or the sugar hasn't dissolved yet. Either way, we have a hike tomorrow. I can barely speak to the camera right now. I was actually just doing the teapot situation, and my hands were shaking. We're gonna cry on the way up, but we have to do it. It has to be done. <laughs> We're an hour away, I think, from Tuqal Mountain. We're literally up at the top of the mountain, just going up meanders, and it's non stop. And to be honest, I think the drive would have been scarier if we'd done it during the day, but we can't even see the edge. But we're on edge most of the time. What's that? But we have Anas here in the back who's like, hey guys, can you just take a break for a second? Because I'm just absolutely getting. I'm gonna. Corsic everywhere, dude. You think so? <laughs> you know? Like, this is so not radical, dude. You know, I'm missing the waves and taxis to be honest. <laughs> you want to sit on the front? Yeah, let me sit on the front. Alhamdulillah, we just arrived on location after a five hour drive. And tomorrow we climb the highest mountain in North Africa. I haven't said he's reserved this place, but I don't think he has. Your man's saying there is no reservation. Crazy. Hopefully he comes down and we get a room in here. But to be honest, it's looking like a bit of a dog box. <laughs> <laughs> like they're gonna pull us on top of each other. Now, Michael, has something to eat or not? And then, you man. Wallahi, this place smells like Ahmed. This is your fault. Usually, he's the pickiest guy. But obviously, because you booked the accommodation. <laughs> I'm telling you, Wallahi, it smells like someone pooed in the room. Hey boys, this is good though. It's gonna motivate us to get out. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 please, please don't waste it. Don't waste it. Spray my uh, pillow, please. This one here. You just dodge mine. Spray my mustache as well. I need to rent out boots because we don't have them. Would have been a mission grabbing them from right in any, so I told the lads you can grab them here. And below, we found the spot. Let's clamp up. The ice is on the house, yeah? Kadu. You're gonna give us Kadu. Kadu? Yeah. I'm actually sick of them, man. But like, I bet you 70% of them didn't even subscribe to you. Yeah. Mingo, yeah. Have they subscribed? Yeah, they subscribed. Can you tell who hasn't subscribed and watches your stuff and we can call them out? The thing to see with these vlogs, they don't get too much reach i just do them for the subscribers so you voice you don't get reach on YouTube. youtube no not these vlogs because they don't support you man. they don't share the video um, and usually climbing the mountain starts with one step my back Allahu Akbar. 